Six investigator Mike Holfeld has been reviewing the 37 pages just released today, and he joins us now with more on this, Mike. Thanks, Lisa. The records are nothing short of riveting, but now a surprising twist. The timeline conflicts with earlier reports of exactly when Omar Mateen actually stopped firing. In the blur of emotion that was the Pulse nightclub assault, Orange County Sheriff's dispatch team was putting panic 911 calls into words and reacting. There are 37 pages of sentence fragments delivered from keyboards, words that offer chilling insight, but also raising new questions as to when Omar Mateen's deadly assault actually stopped. Item, Orlando Police Chief John Mina. Our officers did contain him. Uh, there were no shots being fired after our, our exchange of gunfire with him about 218. Today, 10 days after that statement, Orange County Sheriff's dispatch notes show the shooting continued well past 218. Speaking to victim, complains has been shot in his chest and stomach inside the bathroom at the Pulse. And then this call, females online shooting inside Pulse, advised was shot in arm, have female shooting victim. 21447, per OPD, suspects still barricaded inside the club. They're still trying to make entry. At 21454, advised he heard get him while subjects were screaming and shots being fired. Advised they emptied more than one round of bullets were fired. Multiple subjects coming out. Inside, suspect barricaded with multiple subjects shot inside. Shots fired inside. Need shields. Sounds like an AK. Can hear the suspect yelling in the background. He's got a long gun. Need to get these people out. And finally this, advise people are bleeding out in the bathroom. So I don't think the shootings actually stopped. I think the last time I looked at my phone was like 243, 244 was like, that's when I heard the last shots. All right, think about that. Chief says 218, he just says 244. The documents show a caller hearing a gunshot, quote, possibly from the bathroom at 234.11. In an email to News 6, Chief Mina saying his statements were based on the FBI timeline. He says the investigation is not complete. I'm just starting to go through all this. I'll have much more for you at 5. Lisa? All right, Mike Holfeld, thank you.